Hi everybody, thanks for tuning in to the video on this 2013 F350. Uh, this particular F350 is a pretty unique unit. Uh, it only has about 8,900 miles on it uh, and it is super clean. I'm going to give you a walk around and overview of all the features here and uh, we'll go from there. Starting off up front, you can see that uh, like most of the Ford Super Duties, you do have your uh, manual lock-in hubs up here. Uh, you can alternate between free and locked based on turning that uh, knob there. You are equipped with the, uh, the steps down there as well as the large towing mirrors. These mirrors, if you pull on them, will pull out. They elongate uh, to help you see if you're trailering, things like that. Back in. In the back, it is the extended cab with the 8-foot bed on, so plenty of cargo space there. You can see your matching uh, BF Goodrich tire back here, as well as a very clean-looking alloy rim. And a mud flap, chrome-tipped exhaust. Continuing around, you do have your uh, hitch here with both your 4 and 7-pin wiring there for trailering. Uh, looking inside the bed, like the rest of the truck, inside the bed's very clean. You have a nice spray and bed liner in there. Uh, it's not banged up or dented up or anything like that. Continuing around, matching running boards as well as the mirror and everything here. It is a uh, manual adjustable driver's seat, a manually adjustable lumbar, and your forward and backward movement is uh, right here. It's uh, crank windows and manual locks. So relatively basic in the equipment side of things. It does have vinyl floors. A manually uh, manual four-wheel drive selector there. Jumping in. Like I said, actually I was wrong. I said 8,900. It's actually 8,419 miles on it. It is equipped with the uh, Ford uh, gas motor there. Let's fire it up. Sounds great. Sounds just like new. The whole truck really uh, is pretty much just new. Um, have your cruise control here on the left hand side of the wheel. Uh, coming over here, like I said, it does have the manually uh, selected four wheel drive. When you come up here and notice this on off, that is a locking rear differential. So if you switch that to on, it'll lock your rear wheels together. Uh, between that and your front hubs, if you lock all that together, uh, you'll be able to get yourself out of pretty much whatever uh, sticky situation you get into. You do have all your radio controls here, climate here, and then the integrated trailer brake down here. Uh, you have your manual and then your gain. If you're familiar with towing trailers there. Uh, 12 volt plug over here. The uh, passenger airbag, whether or not that's on or off, as well as an auxiliary audio input down here. So relatively basic in the interior equipment. Uh, not a lot to go wrong. Everything's in immaculate shape on the inside and the outside of the truck. To show you the uh, back seat here, it is the uh, clamshell style extended cab that Ford uh, actually still produces. Um, so you do have space for six seats with the uh, folding, uh, the fold-up middle console there. For six passengers, excuse me. Now the golden question on every, everything uh, everybody wants to know is what's the underside look like? I've showed you that the rest of the truck's immaculate, so we'll get down here on the ground to show you the underneath. The underneath is pretty much the exact same way. There's a little bit of dirt on those, but other than that, I mean, it is pretty much the original factory paint. Everything's perfect. Not a single thing of rust to look at there. Even the exhaust pipes, usually the exhaust pipes get a little rust on them. Um, it's pretty much on everything, even the new stuff. Uh, the exhaust pipe on this thing does not have any rust on it. You see the drive line's got the rust color to it, but it's even that is still black in places. Uh, it's pretty remarkable. The truck was definitely kept inside all its life and very well cared for and not driven much, as you can tell by the mileage. If you'd like to come out and take a look at it, you can stop out and see it at 21518 Great Cove Road in McCallsburg, Pennsylvania. Visit us online at thomasata.com or give us a call at 717-485-4224. Thank you very much.